Hey, you know Gilbert's got a feature on his show which is called What's Your Problem, Chummy? I've intercepted a letter, it's great, this isn't it? This is, Dear Gilbert, you are my dreams come true. <laughs> your beautiful complexion reminds me of a million dollars, all green and crinkly. Your eyes are like pools, football pools. In fact, Gilbert, I love you dearly. <laughs> Who writes this drivel? Kim Wilde. See, the reason I've got you here is I want to talk about this big, big tour I've lined up for you, you see? Oh, really? Big tour. Oh, you'll love this. Yeah. No, you'll love this, because your career will rock it. It will rock it. Yeah. Now, I'll tell you what, I've booked in, yeah. I've booked you in, with, this is definite, we've got 55 nights for you at the Doncaster Don Tropical Garden God. Shed. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah no. I thought you'd like that. <laughs> uh, we've got 177 nights for you and a bucket of airing called Christopher, that should be good. And one night, I can't promise this because it ain't been confirmed yet, but we've got one night in the largest stadium in, in, in Basildon. And it's mm. not definite, but I've got to speak to Thomas the Hammer yet, uh, mm. but it'll probably come through, I should think. Mm. Now, this one you'll love, you'll like this kid. Now, you know the Royal Albert Hall? Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. just round the back there, right, <laughs> they got this, this old newsstand, right? It's been converted into a sort of stadium-type effort jobby thingy thing, right? Yeah. Now, I know you've supported the great, well, the great Gordon Jackson, stuff yeah. like that. I know you've been with him and all that, so you'll be used to all that caper, won't you? Now, failing that, Mrs. Uxtable from Cheadle Hume has offered us a 17-night deal in her larder. Mm -hmm. Now, I haven't confirmed this yet, Kim, because I wasn't sure if you were confident about filling the larder. <laughs> No, I thought you might be able to. So what do you reckon? Uh, this doesn't sound quite me, somehow. I, I knew you'd be with us on that one. Nice one, Kim. So I'll go ahead with that one. Cheers. Yeah. Now, this is about this tour. Yeah. Now, I was thinking, you know, I've taken one or two liberties here, but have you had any thoughts about who you'd like to play with, Kim, particularly? Because I have got just the outfit lined up for you. Great. Great new Great. combo. Yeah? Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. it's Raymond Bottle and his little dog called Harold Butter. Now, he's going to be on a support bill. We've got Saucy Sid, who juggles giraffes. He's good. Gene Pitsy and Reg. The Milk Sisters, they're a good, they're a good group. They're going on for three hours. They do a three-hour set. Mm -hmm. It'll be a two-hour break. Then we get Jeffrey the Toad. Now, he's huge. Mm. He's just, he's just really big. Toad. Yeah, he's mm. just really, really, really huge. Great balloon of a toad he is, this bloke. God, no, this is the wrong... I think this is along the wrong tack. I knew you'd say that, Kim. You're just being I mean, nice, I'm, aren't I'm, you? No, I'm open-minded about a lot of things, but I think That's here right. you're just on the wrong tack. Do you so. think so? Yeah. I think we could get another towel. I'll well, ask the waiter in a minute, but I just sent him away, silly bloke. He was far too tall. Listen, now, what I had the boss on the phone. Uh, we had, mm. See, we had you lined up with Sting and you two and the boss, right, to do a package around the world. Right? I turned it down, obviously. Because, you know, because I'm thinking of your interests here. Now, some of these big names we talked about, like Roy Hudd and Lenny Bennett, they yeah. couldn't do it. I'm afraid they couldn't do it. But I've got some results for you, Kim. I think you should... I don't know, this is, doesn't seem to be your line, does it? You don't uh, have a flair for this. I, I don't oh, want to tell well, you. you know I don't me, like Kim. telling it, because I know you're trying the hardest that you She can likes do. her little joke. <laughs> I love it, the understatement. That's really clever, isn't it? Oh, well, Kim, uh, on to the travel arrangements. And now, just here is the news with... Obviously, yeah, first class if I'm flying, you know, oh, definitely. Yeah, flying. Course, you know, the, the tour bus has to have some sleeping arrangement, like that. Yeah, stuff. of course, yeah, the tour bus. Yeah, well, about... At that stage, you know, I like to have, you know, nice champagne and things like that. Yeah, I don't I think that's see. too much to ask, do you? I think that's quite reasonable. Uh, no, yeah. no, 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 for no, no, for no, no, for <laughs> someone in your no, for your position, uh, someone in your position, mm. you, look, you look very nice, very in my nice. position. The position you're in yes. now, it's comfortable, isn't it? Yes, it's lovely. <laughs> Extra gags, Kim. Extra gags, you can't say fair than I, that. I charge for those. Uh. Ooh, naughty, we'll naughty. Get the bill later. Now listen, yeah. see, I Ooh. had this in now what I had in mind, obviously, all for a bit of a problem on the old flights. Now, have you got mm. a clean license? Um license? Yeah, driving license uh thing. Because I might be able to get a van, you see. No. Now, sleeping, that's all right, that's all organised. You'll be sleeping in a box with Horace. No, hang horse. on, who's driving? Uh, who's driving well we van? hope that you would be I'm able to driving the van. Yeah, didn't mm. you think that would be part of the deal at all? No, not at all. Well, it would be a quite all right, I'll bet, probably, you should think. Mm. Now, also, you will be travelling sometimes by a sort of bicycle come sort of go-kart type thingy job, <clears> right? <throat> it's got pedals. It's got good. pedals, Kim. Right. Great. It'll be good. It'll look good on the CV, yeah. ridden around on a thing that looks like a go-kart and thing like that. Yeah. Done that, you can put on your thing, can't you? Mm. Right. Now, food, that's all right, because we've got a sponsorship deal with Matey O's Dog Food, right? 
Now, what we're going to be doing, it's all meaty and chunky and lovely, and there's a bit of variety, because they're even going to be sending it on the old marillabone jelly. Marillabone <laughs> jelly, I think it's called. Now, Kim, yes. most important of all, money. Money, OK. Have you got any? And uh, now it's time to close this. Here's your...